Hey what's up YouTube, 12 Virus here with another figure review and today I will be reviewing the SH Figure Arts Super Saiyan Teen Gohan. He is the first release of the figure. There's his face. In my opinion he's definitely way worse than the other one. Um, I do like him but Here's a quick little comparison between the two. You can tell this one that I just reviewed yesterday, his clothes, it's the coloring, everything is way better. And this one's belt is actually like red as opposed to this one's blue. I can't exactly remember which one's the right color, but the blue definitely looks better. And the plastic the coloring it's not all that great and the boots compared to this one they're just I don't know he's more dull looking and cheaply made looking I do like him but at the same time he's not nearly as great I like the detail they did with the cape all of that good stuff has a little smudge on the cape you just pop his head off and that's how you remove the cape there he is without it his articulation his arms can rotate completely all the way around the um, shoulder piece to his clothes is move they can move also his arm can go up about that much that piece just popped off and it can still only go really like that much pop this back on there we go he's not too terrible but he's not too great either he has rotation right here at the top of the arm and it just popped apart there we go popping back together <clears throat> his pieces definitely fall off way easier he almost like reminds me of a bootleg almost he has a double joint elbow he can bend it that much he has his wrists can bend a little bit rotate completely this side's the same he has a little bit of an ab crunch then back just popped off he's definitely not all that great See if I can even get him back together. There we go. I think I got him. He can kick up that much, back that much, double joint knees. His ankles can bend that much. His toe articulation can actually go down and then up that much they can rotate completely his articulation is alright definitely not as great as the new one so his faces he came with an extra head Super Saiyan 2 head and you can also tell his coloring is a lot lighter than the newer one he's like really pasty pale so for faces well his head popped off so just pop that out he came with this face that's on the Super Saiyan 2 head kind of a smiling face he came with this plain face
he came with a kind of frowning face. Try to get it to focus. There we go. He came with this kind of looking off to the side face. Came with a yelling face. There's the yelling face, and then he came with just pop on the plain face. Pops the head back on. Came with two fists, and then his arm just popped out of socket again. There we go. He came with this kind of um, martial arts hand. Two of those. Well, it kind of looks like a holding hand. I don't know. And then there is two Kamehameha hands and that's really it for the hands didn't come with very many pop back on the fist take his head off Pop on the cape. Pop back on the arm. There we go. So, all in all, he's really not too great. Especially compared to the battle damaged one. I much prefer the battle damaged one because the shading... The details, all that, way better. But, anyways, guys, this has been 12 Virus with another little review. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for all the support. Thank you guys for watching. 12 Virus signing out.